All right, kids, I'm off to train at the gym. Geez, Lois, you're really taking this seriously, huh? Well, yeah, Brian, why wouldn't I? Well, I don't know, you've just never really been the aggressive type. I mean, you're usually so measured and collected. I know, Brian, but when I stepped into that ring, I don't know, something happened to me. It's like I tapped into this primal wellspring of pent-up anger that just needed to be released. Really? What do you have to be angry about? Where are my flapjacks? Huh? You will recall last night, ere I drifted off into slumber with a nudie magazine betwixt my legs, I spake thusly. Lois, tomorrow morning I want flapjacks. It was a simple message, yet it has gone unheeded. <sighs> All right, Peter. Give me a minute. For every five seconds I do not have flapjacks, I shall break one window. Uh-huh. Look, Lois, it just seems to me that this isn't necessarily the healthiest thing for a woman your age to be doing. Brian, I'm 42, I'm in the prime of my life, and this is what I want right now. You're sure about that? Meg, go make your father some flapjacks. <sighs> okay, Mom. This is crazy. Is nobody really making me flapjacks yet? At this point, you guys are being as irresponsible as I am. Go make your father some